Now there's lots of there's lots of lots of sleds on the market and lots of things that that, that improve uh, hitting. Uh, but I like the Crowder because it's unbalanced. Okay, what we got is a two-man sled and we got weight on the end back here. Okay, it's about 100 pounds of sand. Right now I got it uh, at the plate right outside my door here. I got about 75 pounds of sand down there, and it's working pretty good with the guys that I have. What we're doing with the Crowder is we're hitting parts of blocks. Okay, shoulder forearm. Okay, trying to get your second foot on the ground. Okay, so it should be right, left, left shoulder. Okay, and I'm not into driving the sled. I'm into knocking the thing up in the air. Teach you how to hit. Stop a defender. Stick it. Okay, and raise up. Get the thing going. Okay, you're going to run zone blocking. You're going to get uh, any kind of combinations. This is a this is a long snapper. Okay. Teach him how to how to block just because he got nothing else to do. Okay, we got to make him earn some money. But here's a guy that doesn't even play offense, and we got him. We're teaching him how to hit the sled. Okay, he might get in the game and in, in, in the bind and and help us. Okay, now some of these guys are good, some of them are not real good. Okay, here's a fullback. Okay, techniques and fundamentals. Okay, or across the board. Anybody who's got a block has got to have fundamentals. Same fundamentals as the old line. Okay, they send the fullbacks down. They've got to do the same type of drills. Okay, and this guy does a pretty good job here. Okay, let's get in the tape and see what we got. Uh, let's look at the center and the right guard right here. Okay, we're going to run a scoop. Okay, now the mic is offset here a little bit. Okay, the ball is coming on the inside leg of the tackle on this side. So we've got to we've got to help this guard here control the nose. What we're going to do is we're going to go left foot, right shoulder forearm. Okay, jack that shoulder up in the air so that the guard can take him over, and then we can get out our angle. Okay, this is the Crowder right here. Bang. Okay, same drill we just did on the Crowder. There it is right there. Bang. Knock it up in the air and then get on your path. Okay, it helps the tackle or the guard, the, the, the uh, backside guard to take over the nose. Okay, now what drills he got right there? He's got big bag and fit and finish. Okay, he's got big bag and fit and finish right there. Okay. All right. Now we're going to run. We're going to run a power play over here. Left tackle. Okay. He should be. He should be hitting the Crowder. And you get a double team by the tight end. Okay. If everything plays out like it should. Okay. The guy didn't cooperate. Okay. So he's got to take him on his angle. Okay. So it's fit and finish. Tight end came down on the angle, went to block his backer. Backer came out, so he had a wheel on him. Here's fit and finish. Here's fit and finish. Okay, we've got the crowder on the inside. Okay, one of the best things we're doing right now here in spring ball, and we've got a couple more days left, is, is, is our gap scheme right here. Okay, here's the crowder right here. Knock the shoulder up in the air. Okay, get your second foot down, help the second the second blocker. Okay, now you got the fullback right here. He's trapping the crowder. We're going to get into that in a minute. Okay, fit and finish, fit and finish, crowder. Okay, same thing on the other side up here now. Run the power. Okay, left tackle, he's on the crowder, put your knee right up in his crotch. Okay, he got no immediate threat to his inside gap, so knock the shoulder up in the air, knock the, so knock the shoulder out of the socket, let the, let the, the uh, tight end take over.
Okay. I right, run the biplane out to the weak side. Okay, now we're running the scoop right here. We're trying to scoop up to the backside backer. Okay, here's the crowder shot. Okay, now the guard can take it over and they're not leaving too soon. Okay, now this guy should be B gap cutoff and he should do the same thing, the right tackle. Okay, he's getting held in here. But we've got to be able to build a wall on the back side. This tight end needs to push him on through. Okay. <clears throat> All right, now the guard has got to come down. Here's the crowder right here. I don't know where it went. There it goes. Every time you run a fold, Okay, that's one of the problems that we had with the scoop, okay, with, with these guys trying to scoop to the backer, was that they were grabbing us. So you got to have a little change up here. Okay, he hits the crowder, guard's going to go up and around. Fit and finish on the linebacker, the center on the backer. <clears throat> 